Temperatures continue to climb. Doctors warn us of how serious and sometimes deadly the impact of the heat can be on our bodies. But as it turns out, this weather can also affect our minds and our mood. Team 12's Gabriela Becerra joins us in studio to explain how summertime sadness is a real disorder. Gabriela? Well, Mark Caribe, it's actually very common in colder regions. Winter weather can trigger depression in some people, but a doctor tells me he sees patients for that very same condition during this time of the year in Arizona. Summer after summer. I don't think anybody gets used to this. Arizonans search for the best way to cope with the heat. I just stay inside all day. But avoidance isn't a cure. It's very depressing because it's like a ghost town and you don't see anybody anywhere and then you walk outside and you're immediately reminded of why you're inside. There's a name for this. It's called seasonal affective disorder. Seasonal affective disorder can be more insidious. It's a slow onset. It's not as easy to recognize. A type of depression triggered by the changing of seasons. So summer here in Arizona, especially, we're stuck indoors in the summertime. We, you know, if we don't go out by 9 a.m., we don't go out. Dr. Andrew Carroll tells me he sees patients experiencing different feelings as the weather becomes really hot or really cold. He says it often presents as sadness in the winter, but can bring out a whole different set of emotions in the summer. They have more anxiety symptoms. They feel irritable. While not every case is the same, Carroll says sunlight can be a big factor. So with these long days, we have shorter nights, and people just aren't getting enough sleep. And the Arizonans I talk to say they wouldn't trade summertime sadness for winter gloom anytime soon. I'd rather shovel sunshine than snow. Now I know what's wrong with my co-anchor over here. <laughs> it's like, no, but it is. It's like, I'm, I'm like hangry all yes, the time. Yeah. Except I've eaten, so. It, right, <laughs> yeah. And Gabriella, we want to say welcome to 12 News. Thank you, and I'm, I'm joining from the Midwest, so I can see both sides of this. The snow can definitely make people more sad, and no one wants to deal with it. But you're from here. You're from here, yes, right? I grew up in the Valley, so I welcome should be home. used to this. Thank yes. you. Yes. Thank you. It might take a summer, especially because this is yeah. record breaking. It was a hard sure. week to yes. move back to. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember You're being like, this oh, hot I remember this. Up? I want to say yes, but it's really hot this week. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. Really, yeah. It's thanks, hot for all of us. Thanks for bringing that heat. <laughs> we yeah. appreciate it. Glad to have you with us. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm happy to be here. Yeah.